Welcome to the Windows Computer Technology Channel. And um, another thing that um, is something a lot of people ask, and I mean, this is one where I personally do not agree because I like the way it is now. Um, I think that sometimes change is good, and you know, when you need to move on, you move on. Um, I don't think that the start menu in a way, in a certain way, being in the middle is disruptive that much. But there are things that are missing to make it, you know, lovable by a lot of people. So one of the biggest things asked two years, two years into Windows 11 now, is to have a Windows 11 start menu that actually goes back like Windows 10. So yes, there's a way and you can, you know, tell it to go to put start menu on the left side and so on, which kind of, you know, does like Windows 10 in, in having it on the bottom left. Problem is, it still stays, it still stays as the Windows 11 start menu. So um, the problem is not that it stays like that. It's that it misses key parts of what Windows 10 was all about. And one of them is, of course, you have the all apps list. This is one thing I'd like to see come back. And it's the fact that this list, yeah, it should be there. Actually, when we start the menu, when we have this, we should have our list of apps on the left side. I think that would al already lower the amount of uh, criticism that people are getting on this start menu because you'd see your app list all the time. And the problem that doesn't help is that once you click the all apps to see the app list, well, if you get out and you do something else, if you come back, you're still back at the icons menu. So um, it is nice to have like in Windows 10, the icon of the app tiles and the app list because I think it's a nice combination there, and uh, it's something that's not being driven here in Windows um, 11. There are people that like and want to have live tiles back. Um, I don't miss them personally, um, but yeah, I, some people like them, and it was something that they'd like to, you know, to have. And of course, uh, one of the missing items also about the start menu in Windows 10, Windows 10 had jump lists. So when you were actually right-clicking a um, a software, an option, like here one note, it would open a jump list of, oh, these are the last documents you opened, which is extremely useful because it makes it so quick to right-click an app and open exactly what you want and continue working. Uh, this is gone from the start menu here in Windows 11. So that's another option. So these are all things that are incorporated in what I can read in I want to have a Windows 10 start menu back. Uh, I think what's missing is not that they've changed it. It's that they've changed it, but there's tons of options missing in it. And that is what annoys people and want to have the Windows 10 start menu back in Windows 11. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.